Are you guys interested in getting your real estate license as a real estate agent or a realtor here in Philadelphia? Well, stay tuned. I'm going to talk about what it's like being a real estate agent in Philadelphia. If you guys are interested in getting your real estate license, comment below, direct message me, or feel free to contact me. My contact information will be below. Now, for those of you who still haven't decided or are thinking about getting your real estate license, here's what it's gonna be like, at least for me, as a real estate agent in Philly. Number one, Philly is extremely diverse in its culture and people. So you meet a lot of different types of people and you meet many types of culture, languages. I have to work with many different types of clients, whether it's Spanish speaking, Cambodian, Vietnamese, Mandarin. As you are an agent in a diverse city like Philly, you have to learn how to adapt. Um, and I think it's, it's, it keeps the job fun and it keeps it interesting and you learn a lot. I try a lot of different foods and a lot of different zip codes, new restaurants. Um, that's one of the benefits uh, about b being a real estate agent in Philly is getting to meet so many different types of people. Another interesting thing about selling homes in Philadelphia as a real estate agent is prices of house vary block by block. It's extremely, extremely interesting how you have to know each block and research them almost separately. You can't assume you know, you walk two blocks down and it's different types of houses, different price ranges, different school districts even. And so something that's very interesting is you can be in Kensington or you can be in West Kensington and homes are being developed, homes are being built. And then you take a couple steps or a couple blocks down and now you're in Fishtown and Northern Liberties and homes go up drastically home prices go up drastically and then just a couple minutes away from there is center city you really have to know your neighborhoods and it varies so drastically that that's a conversation i always have to have with clients is you have to know what neighborhood you want to be in and be very specific um, and also know the surrounding neighborhoods not just the neighborhood you're in going along with that it's interesting because once you are going to all these different neighborhoods you're gonna be going to all types of homes. So being a realtor in Philly, you're gonna be able to show a uh, investor's special home, meaning it has holes in the ceilings and a dark, damp, smelly basement. And the outside looks like it should be condemned and it looks haunted in the basement. Then you show that house and then later that day, you're gonna be showing a new construction or a fully renovated home uh, in one of the top neighborhoods of Philadelphia. This goes to show that Philly is being developed and um, I'm glad it's being developed. I'm glad a lot of neighborhoods are being introduced to new construction properties and block by block, um, you know, the streets get cleaned up. So that goes to show you, Philly's home prices uh, can vary. It depends on many things that personally as a realtor, you're not allowed to talk about as well, but as a resident or someone maybe thinking about moving to Philly, or if you're thinking about being an agent in Philly, you also kind of have to know uh, and research and educate yourself on these neighborhoods. I love it. I enjoy the vast variety of cultures, people, neighborhoods, home styles, uh, construction developments. I love working on new construction. I, I, I love selling new constructions. I love uh, seeing investors putting work into properties. Uh, the, the feeling that you know you buy a property in a certain condition and fast forward after construction, seeing the, uh, the finished product, seeing the last final pictures or just going to see it in person all finished up, it's an amazing feeling. It's almost like magic. Uh, when you're helping investors or ho helping homeowners uh, renovate properties or buy a home, renovate it. Um, and uh, if you guys are investors interested uh, getting your real estate license and also being a, a real estate investor, one of the reasons why I got into real estate here in Philly is to be an investor. So it's perfectly fine if you guys are interested in getting your real estate license in Philly. You just have to know what you really wanna do full-time. Is it part-time, full-time? Decide on your own. I decided to do real estate full time and also be an investor. Uh, I love it. I think I learned a lot about the business, buying, selling. Uh, you can get commission when purchasing your own properties. Um, and also depending on your brokerage, when you list your properties, you can also save some money on the commission. So uh, there's a lot of benefits to being a realtor here in Philly. I love it. I love being able to help people. 
uh, and also build a career, build a business out of it and also learn so much, be able to open so many doors and, and have the ability to meet so many people through networking, through having a common goal or a common career or a common industry as real estate. You know, you're able to shake people's hands that you otherwise wouldn't be able to because you have a real estate license here in Philly. Uh, you're able to talk to investors, help them out, seeing how you're able to help them, you know, bring properties to them and also learn about the, the real estate game, the industry. Uh, there's so much ways to build wealth, true long term wealth through real estate. And I'm glad I'm in this business. I, I don't think I would ever choose anything else. Um, if I could do it all over again, I'd do the same thing. If you guys are interested in getting your real estate license, let me know if you guys need help with the process or anything. I'm with eXp Realty. If you guys are interested in joining eXp or just becoming a licensed agent, I can direct you guys to the proper places. Shoot me a text and email if you guys are interested in getting your license. I'd love to help you guys. I love networking. Your network is your net worth. So stay tuned, make sure to smash that like button and click subscribe if you guys want more videos like this in the future, real estate related investing. I will make sure I make those and edit those. It takes a lot of work, so I'd appreciate it if you guys like this video and subscribe. I'll catch you guys next time.